This video is part one in a series of videos where we're going to demonstrate to you how you can use your JIRA environment with Insight Asset Management to maintain and track your professional development activities such as mandatory training, accreditations and certifications. So Insight unleashes the power of enterprise asset management with the Atlassian platform. It provides a modern CMDB used to manage any type of structured data. So you can use the Insight platform to manage all the things that are important to your organisation, whether it's hardware, software, people, facilities, compliance, contracts, or any other type of data. In this example, we're demonstrating how you can use Insight to track and maintain your company's professional development activities, such as mandatory training, accreditations, and certifications. By connecting jury issues to your data, you can dramatically decrease time to resolution and increase the quality of your everyday work. Insight provides a single source of truth, object types, attributes, relationships and dependencies, and visualisation with graphs, reports and gadgets. So if we were to take a look at the object schema that we have created to track our training and certification, we're in Insight here, we click on our object schema, and we can see that this object schema has a number of object types. So the object types in this schema are the job roles, employees, mandatory training modules, accreditations and certifications. Each of these object types has its own attributes. So if we were to look at our job roles and go to attributes, we can see that the job roles have a key, a name, a created and updated date, and they also have some other objects linked to them as dependencies. So we've got our mandatory training modules, accreditations and certifications, all linked as dependencies in our attributes. If I return to the job role objects now, we can see that we've created a object for each role within our company. Each of these roles you can see has their created and updated dates and the linked modules, accreditations and certifications. If I go into our senior consultant role, we can see everything about this role as far as a mandatory training modules. And these are the mandatory training modules that anyone that has this role has to complete. Any mandatory accreditations that anyone holding this role has to complete, as well as the mandatory certifications. These are actually objects within the schema in their own right. So if we were to click on one of these, we can also see all of the attributes related to that particular object. So we can see for our certifications, we have a vendor, an ID, a type, a URL, etc. So we can see the information about that object as well. We can also see our employees who hold this role. So we can see that we have four employees currently holding the role of senior consultant. If I was to click on those, I can see who each of those four employees are. I can then expand any of those employees and see more information about the employee themselves. So I can see some things such as their contact details, their manager, their location, and also any training modules, accreditations and certifications that they've already completed. I also have the availability of seeing all of the activity that's taken place against this role. So you have a complete audit history of any activity that has taken place. So you can see what was created, if anything was added or removed or changed and who did it and when. You can also see an object graph to show you a graphical view of the information contained within this object. So we can see here that we're looking at a tree view. We've got our senior consultant and these are the object types that are actually linked to our senior consultant. So we can click on those and see the reference objects on the side. And like before, we can expand that and see more information. We can also see it in more of a graphical view where it just shows you each object that is linked to this particular object as well. So that's a high level overview of our Insight object schema and the objects and attributes and their relationships to each other.